Investors concentrated mostly on prospects for future growth when trading shares in Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company and Uni President Enterprises Corporation today. Both companies announced major management reshuffles on Tuesday, though the changes were expected and had little effects on share prices. On Tuesday, TSMC Chairman Morris Zhang announced he will relinquish his role as CEO. Taking over as co-CEOs will be Mark Liu and C. C. Wei, though Zhang also said he will remain as an active chairman, providing relief to investors. TSMC shares dropped about 2% today, though the decline had more to do with the slowdown in the global semiconductor business than the leadership changes. There is much reason for optimism in TSMC. It's heavily weighted. Revenues between January and October exceeded 500 billion NT, nearly a fifth higher than the same period last year. And the company has been preparing for John's gradual exit. The most important reason is that TSMC was already on this path. Institutional investors not only want to see who the chairperson is that is leading the company, they want to know whether the company can continue growing into a leader in this industry. On the same day, food manufacturer Unit President Group announced its own leadership change. Strong performances from two of its units, President Chain Store Corporation and Tony Industrial Corporation, brought its revenues over the first three quarters to 325 billion NT, growth of more than 5%. After the group set records in single quarter and accumulated revenues, investors didn't sell off on news of Gao Qingyuan stepping down as chairman. The uni president chairman was already stepping into the background. It was as clear as day. You can see the share price is good because every year profits are stable. In the short term, many investment trusts are taking a sell position on Unipresident, though foreign institutional investors are increasing their stake in the company. They have high hopes for strong future revenues.